Alright, this map is called Blood Gorge. I don't know if this is a multiplayer map, because I did notice there's kind of like some... There's like two teams. So, we'll see what this map is all about. Alright, so there's a weapon wheel. Alright. Okay, so far I'm getting some like Doom 3 type of vibe going on. Just kind of like the slow movement speed and all. Okay. Story. So, gotta find the red key card. Alright, some custom geo going on here. This looks kinda interesting. Oh god. Oh wow. Kinda reminds me of like Phobos Anomaly. Like, just how this guy's mapping style is. Wow. This is pretty cool, man. I like this. Oh, I like these little rocks here. <laughs> Oh wow, so I guess I guess it kinda has like the same system of rage where you can like check stuff. Wait, take what? What am I taking? I don't wanna read, I just heard a pinky. Uh fortunately I had to skip some story there. Cause you know I love like if you can make a good story driven Doom campaign. I'm definitely going to give you a lot of credit because, you know, it was really hard for me to try to come up with like a c good storyline for Secluded, and I think I did a pretty good job, even though I'm sure there's people that probably don't even care about story in a Doom game, but, you know, I've already made two campaigns that pretty much had little to no storylines. I've made a bunch of maps that had little to no storylines, so yeah, you know, I kind of want to do something different, challenge myself as a... You know, map designer and game designer, too. And not only that, you know, I'm a big Bungie fan, too. And Bungie made Halo and Marathon. Both really good FPS games that have good story. Alright. I love the exploration here. Lots of stuff to explore. I swear, this... This must have been, like, taken from... Bloodshot. Like, I'm sure I've seen something like this from Bloodshot. Like, what am I supposed to do? Alright. Okay, I guess it's kind of one of these areas where you gotta just explore. Oh, it requires key cards, so I think this is the red key card here. Oh god, I don't have a plasma gun. Did I search everything yet? Oh. So I think I need to like search for like some corpses. There you go, I knew it. Now I hear a lot of baddies. Oh god, it's a little laggy. I think it's the cackle demon. I could say, like, these guys have a lot more health. Oh my god. They have a lot of health. Oh jeez. Rocking like 20 FPS here. Oh 
Oh goodness. Ha ha ha! Can't do anything. Whoa. Oh, what a cheater, dude. No, wait. Oh, I thought he jumped out of the map. I was like, no. That was pretty sick, though. I like that. You know, just when I thought I could kill that Hell Knight through that little, you know, window there. He decided to fool me. That was pretty sick. Alright, where's that Cackle Demon? I think he's the one that's causing all this lag. Oh god. I'm not really a big fan of the movement speed here. Like, look how slow you move. I don't think there's any way to move faster than this. Yeah, I'm holding my left thumbstick. It's doing nothing. Alright, where is this Cackle Demon? I hear him, dude. Like, I literally hear him. Oh, please don't tell me he went up top to the map. Uh, where's this cackle demon? Wait, I hear him. Wait, yep, he's stuck through that. Oh, that's so unfortunate, dude. Oh, wait, I hit him. Is it worth fighting him like this? Like, how am I hitting him through the player blocking volume with this gun? Oh my god, dude. I'm so glad I killed him. Oh, yes, the frame rate's back. I think I might have had to, like, reset that, you know, if I didn't kill him, because we would be stuck at, like, 20 FPS forever. Ooh, some goodies here. So apparently this map is like really difficult. So far I haven't really noticed anything difficult, but I'm assuming this is probably a one life map. So I'm gonna try my best to like, try not to die, you know. Okay. Stand back. I knew it, we put a C4 here. <gasps> no, no, oh, dude, I can't move. Jesus Christ, these rocks, man, they're like my worst enemy. I'm getting stuck on a lot of stuff today, too. <laughs> oh, God, look how slow I move. Oh, wow, these guys have terrible nap pathing. Oh, my God. Wow, thanks, Hell Knight. You didn't have to do that. Oh, dude, why am I stuck? I do think the area is a bit cramped, I guess. But I'm not gonna say it's too much of an issue. I feel like I just need to learn the map layout. Eventually, I'll understand what to do. And I do like the decoration too. See, this is some. Oh god. All of a sudden, these guys started spawning. Whoa, what's going on here? Why are they spawning so quickly? I don't have like any ammo and stuff. Alright. Right, let's go, baby. <clears throat> I'm sorry, guys, I had to sneeze there. I don't know if this thing kills me instantly. This guy looks like a boss.
Jesus Christ, he has a lot of health. What happened to my grenade? Okay. Come on, die. Okay, that was weird. Jesus Christ. How long the bullet spawns are you? I'm glad he wasn't glory kill only. I thought I had to glory kill him. Uh oh. Not really sure if I'm supposed to fight these guys here. Because I have like little to no ammo right now. I'm gonna try to hit that switch, see what the hell this thing does. There needs to be ammo, dude. I'm getting really low on ammo here. Alright, I think this is good enough. Alright, luckily, that was the last dude because I was starting to get really worried with ammo. Oh no, let's save that. What's going on? Keep pushing forward. So far, I am kind of liking this map, man. This map does kind of feel like, an, like a hidden gem here. It only has seven plays. No one has finished it. No one has raided it. Uh oh. So laggy. Nice try. You know, I'm just trying my best to survive because I think this is a one life map. You know, I never played this map by this author. Oh god, get it! Oh, that sucks, dude! That sucks! I got you, though. Oh my god, the frame rate. I think this guy is on PC, dude, but on console, like, holy crap. When the cackle demons are near to the roof, it makes it so laggy on console. Like, I don't know why it's like that. Say, it's like 20 frames here. <laughs> Alright. I really like this little area we're in here. I don't know what do you call this. Oh crap. Let's go. Let's save ammo here. Wow. Oh. I noticed there's kind of like a lot of ways to go here. Oh, goodness. Someone just did a cheap shot on me. Ah! <laughs> God, man, I have to say, dude, this is what I enjoy about doing these live comm series. I like it when I can find a map that I enjoy, and it's made by someone that isn't... Uh-oh, looks like there's some glitches here, but, but it's made by someone that, you know, we don't... It's made by someone that, you know, we're not familiar with. Always love finding those kinds of maps here. Alright, what's this? What the hell am I supposed to do here? You know what? I got double autos here, just in case. Alright, what the? Where am I supposed to go now? Alright. Just trying to like figure out where to go. 
Okay, looks like we're kind of getting lost here. This does feel like a maze. Can't pull that back. Ah, there we go. Okay. So far, like I said, I'm enjoying this map. I hope there's nothing that's going to anno I mean, annoy me or hurt the enjoyment of this map. You know, my biggest complaint is that it's very slow. Like, you move so slow. Oh my god. And not only that, some of the enemies are ridiculously spongy. But I think it's kind of fair. Like, there's not too many enemies, and it does kind of make it reasonable. Alright, let's go. Uh-oh. Getting some frame rate lag. Why is this... Why is there a player blocking volume? Destroy the nest. Alright, let's look for any goodies here before we go. Alright, let's go. Why did I switch my gun like that? Wait, I move faster! Oh shoot! Why do I move faster now? I knew there's like something in here. There's always like something in this little area. Alright, I see what he's doing. Let's do it. Alright, this looks like it's gonna be a big fight. Let's. Oh shoot! I almost freaking walked it off that map like an idiot. Let me try to learn like the item placements. I feel like this is gonna be a very tough fight because look at all these power ups. Oh, there's a suit. I'm so glad I decided to explore. You see, kids, that's just why you gotta explore. Great accuracy. I'm amazing. Oh, I lost my freaking mask card. What's up with that? Where's my mask card gun at? Is he trying to balance it? God. I don't know if we're at 100% speed. Like, it doesn't feel like 100% speed. Okay, Berserk. This looks like a really... Oh, I think this is like the end. Wait, there's a chainsaw. Wait, we had a chainsaw the entire time? I could have totally increased my movement speed like the entire time, man. So one thing I noticed about this little area right here is it's kind of glitchy. Like sometimes you guy can grab it and then sometimes you can't. Like I don't know why it's like that. It's really weird. Slay them all. Let's go, man. This is actually one of my favorite like hell modules here. Just really be beautiful looking, and it's also fun to fight. Oh wow, this is a lot of dudes. Oh, th but they dropped stuff, so it's not really too bad. Oh, that was pretty sick. Where's this empty? There you go. I wish I had like a plasma gun. Alright, here we go. Let's grab the SSG here. I hear like a pinky or specter. So far this fight isn't too bad. I think are these like wave events? They have to be. Uh oh, now it's starting to get crazy because the L souls are here. Alright. 
I might have to use my rockets here. You know what? I'm gonna let you live for a while so I could go and explore for goodies. I think I'm gonna have to start focusing here. I think this fight is starting to get a little scary here with all the L souls, the big boys, you know, barons here. Nah, I mean, you're not worth glory killing. Oh my goodness. <gasps> oh, jeez! Everything just went wrong in a couple of seconds there. Alright. We're gonna run out. Wow, I suck. I suck. Today is not my day, dude. Just not playing so well. Wow, that was the last wave, dude. Holy shit. That kind of caught me off guard. Those lost souls, man. Watch out for those guys. They don't play around. So now can I press it? Alright. Let me grab stuff just in case there might be more dudes. That was the end. So this level, I'm definitely, I'm definitely gonna say it's a hidden gem. I really enjoyed the custom geo. I think it is a pretty good challenge too, especially the last fight. Although, um, I don't know if he was using wave events or something because it seems like the spawns are very predictable. Like the enemies kept spawning in that one area I was, you know, in. But I did like the last fight, and I did like how he used um that module to kind of end it with like the custom geo and stuff and yeah I'm the only person that beat the map and the first one to rate it so yeah blood gorge so here's the map ID if you want to give it a shot so let me put my thoughts on this map what do I feel I mean how do I feel about this map I do love the custom geo I think this guy is inspired by like Phobos anomaly like just kinda like the design it just really reminds me of like you know some of the maps I played by Phobos Anomaly. It has this like surreal vibe to it, kind of like, and not only that, it's very heavily decorative too, just like Phobos Anomaly. I feel like this guy might be like his lost brother or something, and I I do kind of like how um, his maps kind of feel not as. Um, chaotic as Phobos Anomaly. Like, I do know Phobos Anomaly, he really likes his maps to kind of, like, have a lot of explosion and kind of be, like, really jam-packed with, like, a lot of enemies. While this one, I feel like this one is kind of more, like, similar to Doom 1, where there's not too many enemies, but it kind of has, like, that good pacing, good flow. And there's, like, enough enemies on, like, the map to really please you. And I, I'm not a fan of, like, big health, um, you know, big, I mean, what is it? I'm not a big fan of, like, enemies with big health. But I think, um, this guy, he really did a, he did a good job at kind of, like, balancing it. So I really enjoyed that aspect for sure. And I don't know if there's anything wrong with the map. Oh, yeah. I do think, like, the map does got some weird technical issues. Like, for example, like, the Cackle Demon. Like, why 
did he fly all the way up in the sky and kind of get stuck there? Like, what happens if you're playing on console and you can't find that cackle demon? You're going to be stuck at playing 20 FPS forever, and it's going to be extremely frustrating, you know, for a map like this that really deserves to be played. So, you know, that's one thing I feel like the mapper could do. Maybe try to block the skybox or something. I guess it's because when he was playtesting it, he probably always killed the cackle demon so he probably never stumbled that issue or he could be on pc and never like you know get to witness like the frame rate lag and all that stuff that console users have to get i mean have to suffer but yeah i don't really think there's anything wrong with this map i think it definitely has like the right length and it has good custom geo the gameplay was good i personally think everyone should give this map a shot man like give this guy some attention man <laughs> You know, I'm trying to, like, find people that make good maps and barely, like, get any plays or attention or people don't really seem to talk about, you know. And I think this guy, he definitely deserves it. Alright, move on to the next map.